I think um, one of the most uncomfortable actions in life is uh, when you're not happy with your job and you're thinking of changing job. So that means you have to go through the interview process and it's, you know, it doesn't matter how many times you do it, it is a very uncomfortable uh, process because you feel like you're being judged, you're being picked, right? So let me share with you a story. Um, I was uh, okay with my job. I mean, not completely happy back then. And then I read The Hobbit and I was like, whoa, this is so cool. Actually, I even, I read the comic version of The Hobbit. It's not even the book version. And when you get to the dragon, the, the treasury hunt, I said, like, wow. For some reason, I didn't know that I actually like science fiction, fantasy, right? So I, it's weird because I start imagining, wow, it would be awesome to work on The Hobbit. And, and then it um, took me a long time to keep thinking and thinking whether I should apply to this company in New Zealand that is working on The Lord of the Rings. And... One day I thought, I don't, if I don't apply, how do I even know, right? So it was pretty uncomfortable. So I went to the online um, applications, so I applied. And, and then I thought, oh no, if I, that means I have to move from LA to New Zealand. That's very uncomfortable. I never moved out of a country before, especially by myself, you know, for a job and a totally different country, you know, in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Right, and and so uh, I apply, and guess what? The uh, producer called me, and for the first time in my career, it was not really an interview; it was an offer. And I was like, "Wow, this feels great!" And it turned out that later, I find out that because uh, one of my colleagues is already working there, and when he saw the resume, and he said, "Yes, hire her." And, you know, if I never apply, that resume would never get there, right? Yeah, so, and because of that, you know, incident of applying, that moment that I, I click apply, it changed my life completely. So, I moved to New Zealand, I get into natural health and find out it's a whole new world, and I become a better version of myself, a happier version of myself. So that's why I'm here today, that I could actually start helping people because you always need to be happy and feel uh, complete, right? Because I, before moving to New Zealand, I was very uh, cynical. I was an unhappy person. So yeah, so um, interview, if you have to go through interview, this is, this is my tips for interview. Okay, so it doesn't matter you want to take the job or not, but since you are interviewing, and, and also I was a manager when I was in my first job. So I, I was on the other side hiring people. So when we create resume, I mean, uh, job description, we always kind of overqualify because then we can get the best candidate, right? So when you look at the job, don't get discouraged by saying, oh, I don't know this, this yet, I don't know yet. But you know what? You learn on the job. The most important thing is you're willing to learn and you're willing to adapt and really think outside the box. So you have all the skill. Yeah. So don't be intimidated by, you know, the qualification, right? So when you show up at the interview, before that, you, you have to practice smiling. Always smile because people will hire you if they like you. If, you, if you're very smart and you're just a snob, guess what? I don't think people will hire you. So always smile, always happy. And then psych up yourself that you're going to take this job no matter what, even though you are still thinking. So just have that psychology going in and say, I'm taking this job. You know, I'm going to find out, you know, what, what it takes to help give them you know have them give you an offer but also you're interviewing them too so always show up with very a list of powerful questions intelligent questions to ask them because at the end they always will ask you if you have any questions and if you just say oh no i don't that means you don't really have an interest in the job right yeah so the tips is be really cheerful and 
ask good questions and then do research of the company, find out what the company does and why you want to work for the company. Yeah, so, um, and uh, don't even hesitate when you're inter doing the interview, don't hesitate thinking in your mind, that, oh, should I take this job or not? Will this pay well? Get those crap out of your, out of your mind. And it's never too late when they give you an offer, then you decide. Because if you're not in the driver's seat, why, why are you deciding, right? When they give you an offer, then you ask for time, and that's when you, when you decide. And if you have multiple offers, that's even better than you compare, right? I hope you find this helpful, and um, check out my next video.